I feel that when I came here, I was just a boy that wanted to play soccer and have fun. But being at Judson taught me to be a man. Well, I've definitely been impacted by the Judson community in every aspect of my life. I've definitely grown a lot in my faith through chapel and small groups. I've grown as an athlete. I've grown as a coach. I also coach for a team outside of Judson. And so being able to learn from my coaches and then being able to teach other people, that's really been a huge impact on me. Coach, he offered me a good scholarship. I came here with nothing. He barely know me and he gave me all this. So I will always be grateful for him. My name is Mary Emmington. I'm the graduate assistant here uh, for the softball team, which means I go to school here as well as help coach. I wanted a school that was more focused on Christ and a place that I could find you know, a home with the softball team. Working with the softball team has always been a dream of mine. I mean, ever since playing the game, I knew I wanted to be a coach. And being able to work with these girls, giving them any advice or skills that I've learned along the way, really just fulfills me in everything that I've done. I was actually here in 2011. But after my freshman year, I ended up getting blood clots in my lungs and my leg. So a pulmonary embolism and a DVT. So after that, I took three years off, and then this is my senior year. So I was going to multiple doctors, getting like six or seven different prescriptions. I was taking 20 pills of like Percocet a day, which is insane. I was probably close to dying. So I ended up becoming really good friends with Elisha's sister and their whole family. Elisha Hogan, my uh, doubles partner. So we ended up getting, I was really close with their family without being, you know, judgmental or um, condescending. You know, they kind of made me realize the life I was living. I don't know, one day her and I were just talking. She was explaining the gospel to me and it was like a light switch. Someone had just unveiled who Jesus is and right at that moment it clicked and it was like, I knew I was clean. I was washed right then. We all push each other. Um, both on the court and off the court, physically, mentally, uh, we push each other spiritually. So, I mean, that's like my support group that I definitely rely on and that's probably one of my favorite things. I love it here because of the atmosphere. It's a low population. I love that because you get to connect with more people on a more personal level. And then also, you know, the aspect of softball. It's awesome. I have a good relationship with my coach and the players. They're all fun to be with. We like to stay up and pepped. The program itself, Coach Taylor has been here for a few years now and she's really built it up. We have this high standard and this level of competition that we hold ourselves accountable to and she makes sure that she holds us accountable to it. People care about you. People came watching our games, asking how you're doing in classes and it's really helped for me. We are like a family, a different family, I would say. We treat each other like we are brothers. Judson is home. Judson is my, my home. It's also my family. I love it here at Judson. I couldn't imagine myself in a better place. To me, Judson is awesome.